Hello, it's Daryl at 10 Foot Truck Good Attitude Services. And day number two on my repeat customer job. Uh, truck is not quite as full. But um, yeah, I had a really full truck yesterday. It wasn't too bad actually. I think it was um, about 1,300 pounds, but the truck was completely full. This one here is going to be a lot less. So, uh, but I'm really glad that I was able to help that customer out. They um, they had to they uh, moved out of their house and um, got a new place. So I got it done in a timely manner when they needed it. So you always want to take care of your uh, customers that are repeats. And um, the only tr trouble I had with this with this thing here, um, I don't know if you ever had these really hard plastic uh, playground things. I had to really I had to cut it with the uh, a sawzall to get it to fold in there because I don't know why I couldn't get these things to to come apart. It takes up a lot of space. Other than that, uh, everything went good. But um, it's interesting. I don't know if anyone's ever come across these where you uh, are really hard plastic and they they're you know to try to size them down. Um, I tried my best to try to pull these things out. And I couldn't do it, but. Uh, I was able to get the sawzall and cut some pieces so I could fold it in there. So, um, and uh, let's see what else. They stand up here. It's not really a full load. It's just a lot of now those pieces back there and all these other pieces I had to. Uh, like I was telling you that one uh, in that other video that uh, about having uh, Allen wrenches and um, yeah, the Allen wrenches came in really good handy. And then taking tables apart, uh, having my, my drill tool bag there, the tools I tell you. Or if I didn't have that tool bag now, I'm, I bring my tool bag on every job because, and I bring my dollies on every job because um, I needed those dollies, both of them. I needed the, the, the uh, drill and I especially needed the uh, Allen wrenches to take apart these uh, beds that were the bunk bed type things and uh, because trying to get them through doorways and stuff there was no way and they're really heavy so you got to take them all in pieces and they're all back there all in pieces so if I didn't have the Allen wrenches uh, it would have been probably I don't think you could do it because everything had to be pulled apart to size it down to bring it up the stairs uh, I, there's no way you could have got that thing because it was put together in the room so you, know, you definitely need your tools even on uh, junk removal and uh, moving, you definitely need all the types of tools you need, like I talked about in my other video. But um, another successful load. I'm happy about it. The customer's happy. Um, it's a nice, cool day today. It's a really, really a beautiful day. So uh, happy I'm done with that job and can take this to the dump. I mean, uh, I have a job on Saturday, a moving job. So, um, pretty good, pretty good week so far. Um, one job I had a repeat customer and he canceled. He's supposed to set up another time, so I haven't heard back. And there was another one that was canceled, so. And then there was quite a few load ups, and there's still some uh, that I could possibly do. I could probably even do one if I went to the dump, got this, get rid of this, I could do one of those, but I. I'm not gonna do that right now. So there was three, like three or four of those. So it, it's actually been pretty good for October. I know I've heard people talking out there in YouTube land about how it's slowed down and starting to slow down. Not really, actually. Things seem to be working pretty good. I think I've seen quite a few jobs coming in. Um, things really haven't changed as far as um, what I'm looking at. I think things are pretty much have been going pretty smooth uh, out here. I mean, I'm not getting ton of jobs but I'm getting a pretty good amount um, uh, oops, get back up here yeah it's uh I mean, it's not super busy but it's not so I would say it's slow so um, so I'm happy about that as long as I get work you know anything during the week um, even if it's like three jobs four jobs um, I'm happy uh, just getting that work because you build on it you get those repeat customers you go out of your way to help them out. They're going to help you out later. It's just a win-win situation. Those are the kind of jobs and what you want. And you want to build those win-win situations and those relationships with people to um, 
you know, talk with people to get those, uh, in fact, the customer that I just, this repeat customer was just someone that I had handed a card to. So they weren't even from Craigslist or Google. So sometimes just handing those cards out can get you a lot of jobs. Um, of course I do Craigslist still and I'd like that. And then um, I have my Google, my business. And I've noticed that's been ranking up a little higher, which is interesting because I think it's because I'm doing these videos and posting a lot of uh, content. Um, people are going to my website and going to, I guess that's how it works. I don't know how that works, but I've noticed it went from, like I was way down in the bottom of like the list for chunk removal, way down, like number 80 or something somewhere down there and then it slowly has risen up and now I'm like almost number 10 I'm like number 11 and so if I can get a little bit higher if I get up there in five you know up higher when people search on on Craigslist or Google then I'll start getting some more job or get some jobs off that because I really haven't yet I just started doing that most of my works off Craigslist or just word of mouth or repeat so but anyway uh, so I'm gonna get this out to dump and enjoy the rest of the day just wanted to do another video I think videos are great to do I mean it, not only do I like to do them just because it does help uh, get my name out there on uh, you know so if you look at the website or whatever but it's also good just for reference so when I look back um, prior years I can see um, where you know where I was last year because a lot of times you forget but if you go back and um, look at those prior years you'll see how many jobs you did what the weather was like how what kind of jobs you got and then you can kind of see your improvement which is always important to, to see your improve, improvement and uh, that motivates you to continue on and get better at what you do and uh so forth huh got some clouds up here i don't think it's gonna it might rain i don't know we'll see it's beautiful weather i love this kind of weather um i'm enjoying it gonna be nice all the way through the week maybe through the next week we'll see all right well have a great week uh what's today today is what is today is it thursday october huh. what is today october 12th oh yeah tomorrow's friday the 13th that's funny <laughs> so uh is it friday yeah i think god the weeks go time goes by fast we're already in the middle of October. Hope everything's going great for all you guys out there. Uh, this is Good Attitude Services 10-Foot Truck signing out. Have a great day and a great week and a great weekend.